and welcome to mycatsite.com here I am showing you the first assignment this is on tutorial 1-2 uh, and it's a, just a good one to get you started using absolute and relative coordinates so that you'll be able to learn to accurately input lines and other objects into AutoCAD so starting with the line command L enter and starting an absolute point of 1 comma 2 the next point is 3 comma 2 which means it's going to be 2 units out to the right the next one is 2 units up so I'm going to go to 3 comma 4 and these are all absolute points in AutoCAD back to 1 comma 4 and finally the last point I'm going to go back to where I started 1 comma 2 so now I've got my first square drawn using absolute points relative to AutoCAD's drawing origin the next one I'm going to do is using relative points. I'm going to once again start the line command, but start at an absolute point just so I can place it correctly in the drawing at 4.5 comma 2. The next line is relative to that, 2 units in the X and 0 in the Y, meaning straight out to the right. The next point is relative to that, 0 in the X and 2 in the Y and if you're watching the command line you'll see all the input that I'm using and the third section is going to be relative to that point negative 2 in the X and 0 in the Y and press enter and now I'm going to use um, an option if I'm watching the command line you'll see that it'll say close slash undo so I want to close the box back to where I started and for that all I need to do is press C enter it closes to my original starting point and ends the command now the third one I'm going to do is at an angle and for this I'm going to use polar coordinates but and once again I'm going to start at an absolute point on the screen in this point 8 comma 2 and now I want to draw a line at 45 degrees one unit long so it's at one angle sign 45 degrees next one is at one unit at 200 sorry 135 degrees third section is one unit long at an angle of 225 degrees and once again I can close it and there's my third box drawn next one I want to do is just draw a circle up in the corner now and I could start the circle command I'm just going to type in circle I could use C or use the icon and I first have to enter a center point for where the circle is going to be in this case it's 7 comma 6 absolute on the screen and I can make it any radius I want but being AutoCAD I want it exact and it's going to have a radius of 0.75 so I enter that press enter and there's my circle up in the corner next thing I will do is draw a border around the drawing and this is going to be starting at 0 comma 0 so I start the line command enter my points this is all absolute points on AutoCAD's drawing screen and it's going to be a 10 by 7 box so I've gone 10 units over in the right now I'm going to an absolute point 7 units up and I want to come back 10 units to the left once again using absolute points and then closing it so you can see that there's many different ways to draw lines and I'm just going to dimension this now just to show that yes these boxes are 2 units and the angled one is one unit and then I'm going to dimension the circle and it actually says 0.8 but that's rounded up from 0.75 so I hope that makes things clear for the first exercise thanks for watching my cats